16 days after he made that hate speech, he's finally been booked, but he's still not been arrested. On Wednesday, Praveen Togadia threatened our correspondent. He insulted him and haughtily accused him of not being a credible journalist. And if you permit me, sir, my last question uh, about uh, there was a speech that you made in Hyderabad. No, no, with capital no. You, you have violated the norms and you are not a good journalist with integrity. Thank you so I'm, much. I'm repeating on the record. You are not a journalist with integrity. You have violated the norms and you are not a good journalist with integrity. Thank you so I'm, much. I'm repeating on the record. You are not a journalist with integrity. All right. So Togaria wanted to put it on record saying our correspondent isn't a journalist with integrity just because headlines today asked him to explain himself, explain why exactly he was hell bent upon dividing India, undermining the country's integrity and compromising its security. Togaria has now been booked. It is his credibility or whatever is left of it that is at stake right now. Well, Headlines Today hopes that it won't take another seven days for the police to arrest this hate monger. The man doesn't deserve to get away with the venomous hate speech, the hate rant that he had unleashed and the charges against him are non-bailable. But if history is anything to go by, it's very likely that just like in the past, Dogaria could might get away. This simply because there is just too much at stake politically for the authorities in Maharashtra to enforce the law in letter and spirit. If it really means business, here's what Maharashtra government needs to do right away. Send a police team to nap Togaria, coordinate with Akhlesh government in UP to ensure the operation goes off smoothly and then consolidate evidence against Togaria to build a watertight case. Well, my colleague Vikas Mishra now joins us from Monday in Maharashtra. Ankit Yagi will also be joining us shortly. Vikas, to you first. Take us through uh, the action that could be taken against Praveen Togaria. He's finally been booked 16 days after he made that hate speech. But is the state government likely to arrest him? And how early or soon can that arrest be? Uh, finally, the partial action has been taken against Togaria after the FIA was registered uh, yesterday late evening. Uh, but uh, still police is on the issue where how long it will take for them to arrest Mr. Tugadia. And people here in Nanded are asking why it took extensive coverage by headlines today, uh, made this uh, FIR to be registered and the local politicians over here. Uh, we have uh, with us the local politician here who is asking that why it took police or the Maharashtra government took so much time to register an FIR. I want to know you, you moved an FIR application that you should have an application that you should have an FIR. What do you want to say that the police took so much time to register an FIR? Look, on the 21st of October, Parveen Togaria Ji was born. He had a report on the Muslims. We gave the collector and SP to the 24th of October, and he gave the dedication to him. He gave the dedication to him that you should have given him. ये मुसलमानों के अंदर हिंदुओं के अंदर दोनों के बीच में तफरीका पैदा कर रहे हैं दोनों के अंदर दरमियान में गुट पैदा कर रहे हैं और भावनाओं को दुखा रहे हैं सेंटिमेंट्स हर्ट्स कर रहे हैं मुसलमानों के भावनाओं को दुखा रहे हैं लेकिन यहाँ के सुप्रीम ऑफ पुलिस जाधव साहब और कलेक्टर ने कोई एक्शन नहीं लिया हम छह तारीख को भोकर गए और भोकर जाने के लिए लगता है की देरी क्यों हुई है देरी क्यों यहाँ का पोलिशन यहाँ का प्रशासन तासुब रखता है मुसलमानों के वास्ते इनके पास मुसलमानों की कोई फरियाद नहीं सुनी जाती ये आज की बात नहीं है देश आजाद हुए जब से अभी तक ये हो रहा है हमारे साथ। So you can hear clearly people saying that there is some lack of coordination between the state government, also the police and police are not willing to take action after the extensive coverage of headlines today, which made them register an FIR and there was a pressure building up, political local political pressure building up to register an FIR. But people claim that there is only partial action that has been taken. Now they are waiting the police to arrest Mr. Togadia for the hate speech which has given on 22nd of January 2013. You're right, partial action taken, uh, Vikas, certainly, and that too, 16 days, full 16 days after he made that hate speech. So while Togaria is unrepentant, his outfit, the VHP, is standing shamelessly behind him like a rock. So much so that they now are warning of hitting the streets to thwart law for punishing Togaria for his hate rant. In no uncertain terms, the Saturn outfit has warned the law keepers to stay away from Togaria, holding out the threat of a nationwide agitation. प्रवीण भाई के भाषण में यदि कुछ गलत है 
तो उसके लिए जिम्मेदार है ओवैसी उसके लिए जिम्मेदार है वहां की सरकार जिन्होंने कार्यवाही करने में देर की लेकिन यदि प्रवीण भाई पर कोई भी कार्यवाही की गई तो निश्चित तौर पर उसका देशव्यापी प्रतिक्रिया होगी जिसका परिणाम वहां की सरकारों को भुगतना पड़ेगा पलंकित त्यागी नाउ ज्वाइन दिस फ्रॉम अलाहाबाद वेर दिस टू रे कॉन्क्लेव ऑफ वी एच पी इज टेकिंग प्लेस एंड वी जस्ट हर्ड फ्रॉम सम वी एच पी लीडर्स हु कम आउट सॉलिडली बिहाइंड प्रवीण तोगड़िया even threatening of uh, action if uh, any action is initiated against praveen togaria so clearly um, ankit it seems that the sang parivar the vhp especially is standing firmly behind its leader well they will have to that is uh, how they have dealt with these issues in before praveen togaria if i if, if i may add the, the way he responded just to the query that i gave to him It, it, it was almost as if uh, 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 you know, threatening me, telling me not to ask that question. But as journalists, it is our right to ask questions uh, to people, even if they are uncomfortable. And he, the VHP, and also Mr. Togaria, gets this confidence from the lackluster attitude that the administration has shown so far. Yeah, we have. We, it was. It was after continuous coverage on headlines today that we saw um, the uh, the FIR being registered against him, and we clearly heard um, from our colleague in Nande that uh, it was after repeated attempts the police did not take any action against Mr. Togaria. So this is what uh, emboldened Mr. Togaria and uh, um, other members of the VHP. They are threatening a nationwide uh, agitation if Mr. Togaria is uh, arrested. So clearly they are building up pressure. now it will be up to the government to make sure that he is arrested and an example is made otherwise uh, hate mongers like him uh, will be free to do to say whatever across the country well there can be no double standards for sure and it's the intentions of state government the center and other political parties uh, that are at test here vikas mishra ankit yagi thank you both for joining us uh, on a quick update on that story so he has finally been booked 16 days after making that hate speech will he be arrested today that's the story uh, we are looking out for